And so it's my great pleasure to introduce um, our very effective spokesperson, uh, actor, uh, and star of the, the large and the small screen, um, Jennifer Beals. Thank you, Andy. The bells are ringing. That's right. <laughs> it's a pleasure to be here among such inspiring and energizing advocates. And like many of you, I started my journey in the quest for strong laws on toxic chemicals because quite simply, I am a mother. And I am tired of feeling like I have to have a PhD in toxicology in order to be a competent parent. I am tired of being a detective, hunting the internet for clues as to what product is safe and what product is not safe and why. I am tired of trying to shop my way around this problem, deeply aware that not everyone is able to do so. I am tired of debating school administrators about artificial turf fields with crumb rubber, those black pellets that get everywhere and anywhere and that contain lead, phthalates, butadine, styrene, benzene, carbon black, a whole host of polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, and now flame retardants. I am tired of reminding school administrators what is good for a tire is not good for a child. I am tired of hearing the school say, well, the company says there's only a little bit of lead in it. Repeat after me. There is no such thing as an acceptable level of lead for children. You can just ask Dr. Helen Binns from Children's Chicago, Chicago's Children's Hospital or Dr. Philip Landrigan from Mount Sinai in New York City. I am so tired of reading quote unquote scientific studies that say a product is safe only to find the study was funded by the industry it is just exonerated. I am tired of having chemical companies untested concoctions run through my veins uninvited. Dow, DuPont, ExxonMobil, you are not invited to take up residence in my DNA. Let this serve, let this serve as an eviction notice. We are all tired of you barging into our sacred homes, our bodies and the bodies of our children. Dow, DuPont, ExxonMobil, we know you have the talent pool to do better, to come up with truly green chemicals. Let this serve as an opportunity to win back our confidence. We look to our government to provide our basic rights of clean air and water, and yet right in front of us, in things we may be exposed to every day, like our couches, household cleaners, toys, or synthetic playing fields, lie toxic chemicals that have, for the most part, gone untested in their effect on human health and certainly have gone untested in aggregate. For me and for many of us here today, this is simply not acceptable. I am proud. I am proud to stand together with Safe for Chemicals Healthy Families for today's Stroller Brigade. Together, we will send a message to Congress that the time has come for strong laws on toxic chemicals. There is nothing more important than protecting the health of our children and generations to come. And no one's profit margin can justify harm brought to our children and to future generations. Thank you.